guys. Whew, it is, it's hot. It is the next day. Um, we just chilled and, um, you know, everybody just rested. I just, me and Tara had a marathon of um, Orange is the New Black because they got a new season on Netflix. But Tara hasn't seen, she stopped at like season two. So we've been, you know, just having a marathon and watching, um, watching that and catching up and stuff. And, uh, yeah, so I'm just on my way out now to grab some orange juice. Um, you know, they need some vitamin C, so I'm gonna go grab some orange juice. Oh, and some bread. And then I'm, I'm, I'm sweating like it ain't nothing. And I just got outside. That's how hot it is. Um, so, yeah, I'm just about to run there. I got my little roadie with me. Hi, booger. Hi, booger. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. Um, Mark seems to be feeling better today, which is a good thing. So, um, that is awesome. And Tara started to feel better a little bit yesterday. So, you know, Mama's doing her job. <laughs> so, so, yeah. I'm not going to be out much today other than editing editing video um i'm going to post this one and then i'm gonna post some other videos and they're gonna be like throwbacks because i have a lot of footage like i i'm always recording but i haven't been editing to upload on youtube and i need to change that i need to change that um so i'm gonna be editing and stuff and um oh, yeah i'm gonna take something out the freezer today i don't know what i'm gonna make today um because hopefully they can actually eat so i think i might make something light but i don't know what i want to make yet so might freaking make some homemade soup you know put some chicken in the soap cooker with some veggies and stuff i might just do that oh, but anywho let me go to the gas station because it's hot as shit i barely wear sleeveless stuff outside and that should tell you guys how hot it is because I, I hate my arms i'm just going to go and um yeah do this come back take me a shower clean and cook and you know get my day started it's almost 11 o'clock and I'm just getting my day started I've been up for a few hours but you know got chill oh my lips popping from some chapstick <laughs> but anywho all right guys I'll see y'all in a little bit what up guys um obviously back home um yeah, so I just wanted to kind of sit down because I've been wanting to talk to you guys like about uh, my weight loss journey. Um, I had started to like, I, I, you know, like over the years people, you know, like, oh, I'm going to go on a diet. I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this. I've tried so many different things like the keto diet. No, you know, like the that, just the no carb diet. That water diet. That one oh yeah water water diet I, I tried many things but nothing ever stuck and oh the juicing diet i did the juicing diet that lasted a day so i was so hungry like it wasn't like it wasn't filling like at all i keep looking that way tara's over there but um yeah so like nothing ever stuck and then um you know all this stuff happened to mark and you know like and everything started to work out good so he was able to get into um the bariatric stuff at you know the local hospital and so he'll be getting you know bariatric surgery so you know before you can get surgery you have to do things you know that the insurance wants you to do before you can you know before they will approve you for surgery like you know lose a certain amount of weight and you know stuff like that so I was like, you know, Mark has to follow this diet for, you know, five or six months and it's the perfect time for me to start doing something too, you know? So, um, I didn't go strictly on the diet that they have him on because they have him on a liver reduction diet, which is like no carbs, no sugars, no fats. Like it's really strict. Like he could have lean meats and not even all types of vegetables, but he could have like green beans and stuff like that, tuna, um, he can have low-fat Greek yogurt. Um, he can have any fruit. So this diet, that diet is really strict. So I was like, I'm not going to be that strict, but I'm going to really watch what I eat. So, you know, starting the whole weight loss journey, um, my highest weight was 
297 pounds so I was three pounds shy of 300 pounds um so I was like you know something's got to give I'm gonna put a picture right here this is like a picture of when I was my biggest um so you know this just gives you guys an idea and excuse me so you know I was like something's got to give because my body you know on top of already having health issues issues that weight was just putting a toll on my body so I started you know like watching what I eat you know like I still have my carbs and stuff here and there you know like I don't totally restrict myself of stuff you know like I still like this morning I had some eggs but I had a piece of toast you know and I still will have you know like some rice and you know like if, if I feel like having spaghetti I'll look for some of the healthiest noodles you can buy and like make spaghetti I know that there's veggie noodles and stuff like that but I just haven't gotten that far yet but um you know, like, I still have my bad days. I still have my days where you'll catch me putting my hands in Tara's chips and, you know, stuff like that. And so it's like, so it's like, you know, I, you know, I, I'm human. <laughs> I'm human. So, um, but, you know, like, I've really been, you know, watching what I eat. I've been having a lot of days of slip-ups where, like, I'll eat garbage for a few days and I'll probably gain, like, six pounds or something. And then, you know, I'll get back on track. But... Um, you know, like I said, I'm human. That's what happens. But, but yeah, so everything has been going good, you know, like I haven't even been going to the gym. I went to the gym, what, twice? Once? Once. Um, because I haven't went at all since Tara's been gone. And I went once since she's been back. Because I just recently got a gym membership at Planet Fitness, which I'm so excited about. But I'm definitely going to be going back more. It's just that Mark and Tara have been sick, so... I haven't been in the past few days but um but yeah so like mo most of my change with my healthy lifestyle has been diet and they do say it's like I think it's like 70% diet or 80% diet and 20% gym or something you know something like that but the bigger of the percentage is what you eat so um and the same goes with Mark you know, he hasn't been able to work out. Obviously, he's in a wheelchair and stuff like that. He can still do some stuff, but he hasn't been working out either. But, um, but you know, all this in a nutshell. Uh, as of today, which is August... Today's the 9th? Yes. As of August 9th, 2018, I've lost 57 pounds. I'm down today exactly to 240 pounds. So, I'm 3 pounds shy of losing 60 pounds. I can't believe that like three pounds shy of losing 60 pounds <laughs> like that's amazing I never thought it would happen like you know because of like all those times where I did diet and I didn't see like a drastic change and all that stuff I was like oh it's never gonna happen I'm just gonna be you know like a bigger person you know a lot of my family is big you know like they're big bone and so I was like you know I'm just never gonna I'm never gonna lose this weight but actuality it's been helping you know I, ha I don't take diet pills or anything like the most I do is this which is the teamy skinny and one of the reasons why like I use this is it helps with stomach bloating it, like it really helps with stomach bloating like and I you know me with my health issues I have a lot of stomach health issues I have IBS gastritis like I have a lot a lot a lot of stomach issues so I do get quite bloated quite a bit you know so this actually has been helping with that and my this bag was more full but my mom she actually got me for some um she I put some in a Ziploc bag for her she thought I gave her some marijuana <laughs> she's like what is this weed <laughs> but um but yeah so uh she actually really likes it she likes the taste um but that's this is like the only thing that i've been like having like that's not like in a normal diet or whatever like i like i said i haven't taken any um i don't take diet pills or anything like that I, no protein powders and shakes and stuff like that you know i do drink plenty of water um, plenty of Gatorades and Powerades and stuff not plenty but because it's a lot of sugar and stuff in there but you know I'll like have those to replenish my body and stuff but um still have my occasional coffee and things like that but um yeah I just really really watch what I eat because before I think that my calorie intake was really high I probably was at like 3,000 calories a day if not more um and now I'm down to like 1,200 calories a day um, I'm five foot one, so 
um i'm a smaller person so i don't need to eat a lot of food but um but yeah so that's how that works. right <laughs> Yeah, Tara's five feet and she eats more than I do. Well, not right now. Right, yeah, she's sick right now, but normally she eats more than I do. And I'm freaking 200 pounds on her and she eats more than me. But I am older, my metabolism isn't working as well, you know, so, but it's like, it's crazy how that works. But, but yeah, you see, she over here talking about pizza. Y'all see why I can't stay on track? I haven't eaten. Yeah, but she hasn't eaten. Pizza. Now she's getting her appetite back because she has some sort of stomach virus. So when y'all know when y'all have a stomach vi virus, y'all can't eat shit. But um, but yeah, now she's wanting everything: freaking pizza, fried chicken, everything. And some fries. <laughs> everything. But but yeah, I wanted to come on here and give you guys the good news. Um, I had just pulled out my calculator on my phone, like fifty-seven pounds. Fifty-seven pounds. Like that is amazing. That's amazing. But, um, I'm, con I'm continuing. Um, I'm, you know, I'm doing a damn thing. I'm gonna get to the body that I want. I'm gonna get these bat wings gone, which this has, like, dropped so much. Like, look at this. Like, yesterday was the first day in probably a couple years where I, well, I would say maybe a year and a half, maybe, that I, like, ha I hadn't worn, a like, a sleeveless shirt. And I actually wore a sleeveless shirt yesterday like out and about like I don't do that that's out of my norm so y'all could tell I'm getting a little bit more comfortable my stomach is going down which is one of the big things because my stomach was so big and now it's going down to where like before you know how they say you got that that um well, up here in Wisconsin people are like oh you got a booty do stomach like your stomach stick out more than your booty do I had one of those bellies where when I looked down all I saw was stomach <laughs> yeah so <laughs> so um so yeah so i had one of those stomachs but now when i look down all i see is boobs you know and it's just like it, it's awesome like i'm seeing i'm physically seeing the changes i'm seeing the changes in the mirror which you know like it, it's just it's just so awesome it's so awesome like i'm excited and i will definitely keep you guys up with the journey um, but yeah i'm i'm like so stoked like I'm so stoked and oh and you guys keep track of Mark's journey as well he is um he has a YouTube channel Tara does as well um he is uh showcasing his whole bariatric journey so bariatric appointments he's not like recording every appointment but he's talking to you about each appointment and um you know he'll probably do clip some he'll he you know he post some clips of appointments and stuff and he's gonna do the journey through you know his surgery and all that stuff and he's lost so far as calculating from you know the last appointment he's probably lost more because it's been a, a couple weeks since his last appointment but as of his last appointment he's lost 109 pounds in five months 109 pounds in five months and almost 60 pounds in five or six months like it just tells you like how a man and woman's body but like i'm grateful like i'm so grateful i'm and i'm so excited and i can't wait to see where we are this time next year that's gonna be crazy i'm really gonna look like a lollipop i'm gonna have a small body and a big ass head <laughs> understood that my channel's completely different. I don't do health. Yeah, Tara, like Tara doesn't do any. She does like beauty and all that stuff, you know, like vlogs. Yeah, she'll probably do some food videos and stuff. So, but their channels are always linked down in the description. So, click the description, go and support their channel, go give, go subscribe, go show them some love, watch their videos, comment. I know that Tara just recently posted um, a video of behind the scenes of a photo shoot that we did. She hasn't posted those pictures yet because we haven't thoroughly went through them. Um, I, I went through them um, and like deleted some of the ones where, you know, like the face is all awkward and stuff, you know. Um, but, uh, you know, we have to look through those pictures. But, but yeah, go show her some support too. But thanks guys for watching. Um, I just wanted to give you guys an update and let you guys know what the heck is going on. And, um, yeah, follow my social medias as well because I am going to post a lot more about my weight loss journey on my Instagram. So, so yeah.
that's what it be that's what it be guys but all right thanks so much for watching make sure you hit that thumbs up button make sure you subscribe it's somewhere right here right here or right here something like that make sure you subscribe and to keep up with this crazy crazy journey that i'm on and um yeah i'll see you guys in the next video